Greetings to you humans, I am Shadow and we're back with home. Uh, last we left off, uh, we had a bad run in with Kuma. And yeah, things happened. So, yeah, Oliver, the Oribaka showed up. That Oribaka, that Baka, just you. <laughs> You, you sly, you sly bastard. I don't even know. Good morning, Poppet. Did you sleep okay last night? Yes, I did. Did you find the thing you were looking for? Not yet, I'm afraid. But we'll have to, we'll have to talk about it later. Some friends of mine are coming over, and we need to prepare for their arrival. What kind of stuff? Well, what kind of stuff do we have to do? Well, let's see. Could you choose some help here in the kitchen? Do you think you can handle that? I can do that. It's lovely. It's been a while since I've baked with an assistant. Here we gather the ingredients, then we'll bake. So what, I, so what I'm preparing right now is very trifle. Every cake, cream, and lemon curry, I have a jelly really to get, but I'll need you to get the fruit. Need a lemon. Need lemon. Lemon. Uh, lemons. Don't mind me, just using a notepad thing to cheat. <laughs> Last days. I also need some sugar. That's a lot of stuff to remember. No, I thought you might say that. Just know I made a list for you. Oh, okay. <laughs> just look at that list if you need help, alright? What should be in the battery over there? Got it. Got it. Got it! <laughs> yeah. Oh god. The blueberries. Strawberries. This <laughs> is what's Tarzan. <laughs> Fruit. It's like I got everything. Okay then. We got the ingredients. Good job. Let's start making a trifle, shall we? Since I'll be doing the lovely lifting on the stove, I want you to read out the directions. Study the recipe carefully and I'll ask you what needs to be done. Yeah. Try to follow the directions to the letter or else it won't turn out well. Right, sorry about that. I literally just noted it all down, basically. <laughs> because I am a horrible cheater and everything needs to be precise. Are you ready? Let's begin. How much blueberries do we need? One pint. How much raspberries do we need? Two. How much strawberries do we need? One pint. We'll need to simulate make sure how high should the height how high should the heat be? Who's medium weight? Yeah, And for how long? Three minutes. Alright, the very next one is done with cooling. What do we do next? And finish. That was fun. I never met a travel before. <laughs> that was I didn't even realise that was Peter. This is indeed. It went pretty smoothly if I do say so myself. That's because you bake a lot, isn't it? You're like a master of baking. <laughs> I wouldn't call myself a master baker, but I am pretty good. Or maybe the travel would turn out well because I'm a master assistant! <laughs> Goodness, look at the time. I guess she'll be coming any minute, any minute now. I'll clean up here, just head on upstairs and change into something presentable. Oh, do I have pink? I think they look fine. You've worn that overnight already. I feel like you're still wearing your pajamas. These aren't pajamas, these are my regular clothes. Now, now, Peter, no buts. You can leave your clothes on the bed. I'll watch them later. Okay. 
<laughs> it's just say don't you even try, boy. There's a lot of outfits. Ooh. What should I wear? Probably gonna have to go with the black one because it's less noticeable. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> that doesn't look too bad. <laughs> I didn't even want. <laughs> I should have waited for something different, shouldn't I? <laughs> should have done something different. <laughs> now I look like card bars. <laughs> He's like, hey! It's been so long. Come on, make yourself comfortable. One of his friends must be here. I should get out and meet them. Can yeah, I just... Okay. Whatever. <laughs> I should have done something. I didn't realize it would be these card bars. <laughs> I am just... What? <laughs> oh. Next, you'll suggest making a flower ground with a lamp of the moonlight. Do you think this is a first date? I get that reference. I get it. What's wrong with that? It's adorable. It sounds remotely effeminate. You know, <laughs> no, Lucio. If it sounds remotely effeminate, you know, Lucio will have to hate it with a passion. Good time if I go in here and visit up and meet our visitors. What? <laughs> Oliver? No, no, not Oliver. Oliver is the person I'm speaking. I'd like to meet Luciano and Flavio Vargas. Ciao, bambino. Nice outfit, by the way. You're dressing up for Halloween. I'm afraid you missed, the de missed up the date. What do I have next year? I didn't even realize that it would be this! <laughs> Really, Oliver? Another one? ANOTHER ONE! <laughs> You're such a motherhead. Why do you keep fighting? Why do you keep fighting them anyway? <laughs> you didn't exactly find them, per se. It's a long story. You see... And that's how Peter came to be here. Ta-da! He's an absolute. He's been an absolute dear. Not the way around the house where the boys are out. Hey, your mother made this travel. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Somebody's finally thinking after you, Oliver. <laughs> you say like that, it never happened, Flavie. <laughs> Speaking of things that never happen, I believe my dear brother has some bus business to discuss with you. After all, we won't get, <laughs> get anything done sitting here like a pair of tutoring grandmothers. Little devil and I share some healthy bonding. <laughs> bonding, well, you two haven't not sneezed it heart to heart. Oh, that's right. Did you come here for advice, Luciano? What? No! Flavio dragged me! <laughs> oh, I'm sure whatever it is, I can help you out. I don't need! You see, I've just got the hold of this new book some time ago. It's how, how to treat your. F okay, that's going too fast for me to read. I. Went far too fast for me to read, so. Well, that never gets old. Can we have some more fun? Uh, what about your brother, Mr. Vyas? Is he gonna be okay? Mr. Vyas? You might see up with Lucy if you can call me that little devil. You just call me Flavio instead. For Lucy, he'll be fine. You. <laughs> the worst he'll suffer is getting his ears talked off. His ear talked off. Flavio driving. Now what I do is the question. Hmm. Do you know how to jump rope, Mr. Fabio? Well, don't you know me, I've never tried. <laughs> Why not? It's really fun. Not the 
Christmas party person. I'll stick to the sidelines for now. <laughs> What's in the sidelines? Well, thank you. Oh, it has a way with fragrance oil, as usual. Really? It smells funny to me. That's because the nose of a child can't comprehend scents like an adult. <laughs> like an adult. New orchids? No, 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 no. What do you mean new? It, it's not important. Forget I said anything. <laughs> I know that sound effect. <laughs> I can't. Who got that bottle today? I'm not sure. It's where I go when I only sat in my room. But it's not sale of ours outfit. I'm going to do a magic cap. This is what you usually wear. What's for simplicity, little devil? <laughs> So calling him a little devil I did not mean to. Do you ever write stories on your board? No, more than an artist than a writer. It comes with being a fashion designer. Hmm. Where to go? Check with a palm tree. Is that a piano? Basement, what? <laughs> Not here, little devil. Let's go somewhere else. But where is somewhere else? I don't know where somewhere else is. Where did you find eggs? <laughs> I can't believe this dynamite. <laughs> I don't know, I need to keep some of it. I can think of a few things of myself. What are they expecting? <laughs> what am I supposed to do? I killed her! <laughs> Why are they so loud, little devil? Don't call me little devil, I swear to god. Just no. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> I am pure. <laughs> I am pure. <laughs> so what do I do? I don't know what I do. Just what? What do I do? <laughs> Probably something in the science is what it is. This. And I don't know what to write. Oh, 
Oh, this is fake! Hmm. I have no idea what I should be doing. Hmm. What do I do? I don't know how to stick with that word or anything. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Gladio, you jerk! <laughs> Which is supposed to be spending some quality time with all of us kids. Yeah, these kids are going to too. I don't need a tour, you've been here before, idiota! Oh, you know, I escaped a laugh with you. Ta-da! <laughs> hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what I was supposed to do all this time. Not bad. Not bad at all. You really spiced up the place, huh? Last time I stayed here, the wallpaper burned my retinas. <laughs> You've been here before? Yes! Oh yes, many, many times. You called the slumber party for grandma after the funeral. It's usually so far out of here when the boys are around, let me tell you. Alex is a terrible roommate, I swear all the shit he does on night is on purpose. <laughs> Making me lose my precious beauty sake. At least Matt is somewhat better. Not like he gives a fuck anyway. Alex? Matt? Who are they? Oh, that's right! You haven't actually met them yet. You didn't actually think all of them lived all alone, did you? Not quite a little. Hmm. Hmm. My general love is that pretty loud there, do you think? Oh, is the only person I've seen here, other than the pets, that is. You should ask him about them later. <laughs> You'll have to meet them eventually, anyway. That's Italian, hold on. Italian, come here, come here! Italian, come What was that? <laughs> no, not like Lucci. When Lucci gets like that, it's not good. Let's go check it out, shall we, little devil? I guess his nickname for you depends on what outfit you have. Not all of them. His hat is gone. And his. His eat definitely. <laughs> it's the devil's gun, I swear! Black is cold and just as fire! Oh gosh, Lucian, I'm so sorry. I didn't know he was hiding there. <laughs> What's going on? What's all that look? <laughs> Flavio, this is serious! <laughs> Irritating cops stole my hat! <laughs> right now, I was fancying it out somewhere, running my hat like a bunch of honor! <laughs> No, well, I know you're angry, but Alex won't appreciate you exacting vengeance on his feathered friend. I'd be happy to take full responsibility for now, but once he gets back, I will talk to him about Eats' behavior. Can't you just catch the damn thing? Let me do up for you. Do some of your caliber. You think I haven't tried that yet? It runs too fast to be cornered! It's all running after that slippery cock, I dare you! Machine <sighs> sounds 
Why should I? He <laughs> said, why should I? It's not like I took anything of mine. Besides, it's just a hat. You can easily get more of those. Excuse you? That part of <laughs> That hat is part of an authentic Italian brigade uniform. I know what not. Allow its history to be mocked. Alright, that's quite enough. Luciano, you, you won't get close to getting your hat back if you can Flavio keep fighting. I'm sorry, Peter, but do you mind looking for eggs for us? I have the feeling Luciano will be very merciful towards him. Sure. Thank you. I warn you, eat isn't your average chicken. It will be easy to catch you, mind you. Hm. Get that cock. <laughs> if I find that cock, I'm going to make dinner out of him! Pussy would make a better cock than a cock. <laughs> Luciano, please stop using terms like that. It just becomes awkward. Eats might be small, but he's a very intelligent bird. And let him be smart enough to find a good hiding place. Don't worry about me, little devil. Folks are looking for eats. No matter how good your hiding spot is, it's pretty useless if you can't keep quiet. God damn it, Lise. Get back here. Or the cat where the cat is. Heat. There you are. There you are. Get back here. Give it up, Higgs. How's your turn in the hat? And that hat to Mr. Butts. He's scary when he's mad. Oh no, not madness happened. Goodness. Found him! Found the eats! Ha! <laughs> Come here, you little- Ha! <laughs> no, bad rooster, give me that. There you are, Luciano. Again, I'm really sorry about that. Like hell you are. <laughs> Let's hope this doesn't happen again. Come on, Mooji, it's just a hat. It's not even a good looking one. Maybe you're just a trash. <laughs> Maybe to you it's just a trashy hat, but it's important to me! I have written on a pretzel. A story of the nun. I have no idea if I'm pronouncing that right. So sorry if I'm not. <laughs> well, there it goes. He's been fuming in the whole ride home. At least he got his hat back. And all bags to feet. No. At least he got a sad back and it's all thanks to Peter. Why don't you go ahead and put the eggs out in the, in, in the back garden? Back out. Back garden. I don't know. I don't know anymore. <laughs> okay then. Come on, eggs. Okay. I'm just gonna watch them go on it. Is that your yep. He's a good kid. Got a good head on his shoulders. Really? No, they don't approve of each other unless they know Luciano. <laughs> ah, ah, guilty as charged. They just make me wonder. Is that how door really is? I know I do. Oh, no. If I was Kuro, I'd probably call you Uribaka right now. Yeah, he does that a lot. <laughs> Seriously, they're all over. Cool. 
There, you've got a lot of trouble today. No, you're not supposed to follow me inside. Shoot! Such a handful. How does Ollie put up with you? Maybe I should check on Mr. Vargas. Maybe Madeline needs this girl in this hat. Well, that's all I have time for today. Well, not today, but like right now. So! Oh, this is getting pretty crazy. <laughs> well, that being said, have a good day, humans. I will see you all next time. But until then, keep being awesome.